it's official. This is my first video. To be honest, I'm not really into welcome to my YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button. So to keep it short and simple, this following presentation is about my story and how I'm graduating college in the United States as an immigrant. So I hope this helps you and inspires you today. Let's dive into it. Hey everyone, I'm Marian Redcon, and thank you so much Mr. Glass for that introduction. I have three goals today. The first one is for people to look at me and based on the outfit say, yes, she is in marketing. <laughs> the second one, you will listen to it as I tell you my story. And the third one is, you will find out it's a gift that I have for you. So let's get started. And in July of 2018, my mom and I made a life-changing decision to leave my beautiful country, Venezuela. We moved to the United States, where my older sister was waiting for us after four years without seeing each other. And she was waiting for us in Thomasville, while she was going to Thomas University. My father has never been in the picture, and yes, he's alive. So since I was born, I had to see my mom fight for my future to provide food for my sister and I without any support. The economy and stability, insecurity, and lack of opportunities in my home country left me feeling hopeless, like my dreams were stolen. But I refused to let my circumstances define my future. So since the day I stepped into the United States, I knew that I was going to fight for my future and give back to my mom. Starting from scratch in a new country was not easy. We had no money, no jobs, no friends, no family, and I didn't even speak English. I took my junior and senior year in high school at Thomasville Central High School. And something I'm very proud to say is that this young lady who didn't even know how to ask to go to the bathroom graduated with honors with a great GPA. Not only that, but she received her first Georgia State Award as an exemplary English learner. After I graduated, I knew that I was going to go to college. Still, because of my status in immigration, I knew that it was going to be almost an impossible goal to accomplish. But I like challenges, so I took it. I came to SRTC, started my first semester in business management, and quickly realized that although I love businesses, that career path was not for me. Since day one of my student career, I've experienced different challenges. I've gone through financial challenges, stress, and even anxiety. I always applied to scholarships, but did not always get them. And I don't blame anybody. Every single student deserves the best. And everybody's journey, nobody's journey should be judged or compared between worse or better. I've always trusted our SRTC staff. I believe that each one of us has a purpose in life. I'm so glad that I had a conversation with myself that made me realize that. My passion for marketing started early in my career. Not only because I like to take pictures, record videos, or because I was born in a generation where technology is taking place. I asked myself, Marianne, what do you want? How can you make an impact? How can I help others? And here's what I found. I believe that a country's economy is based on its businesses, right? And coming from a country where I saw an entire country's economy fail, of course, I saw many businesses fail as well. That clicked for me. My purpose in life is to help businesses grow with one of the most powerful tools nowadays, which is marketing. And that's my way of giving 1% to our community and leaving the world a little bit better than how I found it. It's been three years with the same schedule. I work full-time in the morning and study full-time at night. I used to work at Senior Life Insurance Company in Thomasville, Georgia. I was there for two years. I started as a customer service representative until I fought my way up to a social media position in the marketing department. Now I work remotely at a global company that operates in 40 plus countries. 
I manage the social media corporate accounts such as Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter. And trust me when I tell you that I love what I do. Working full time and studying at night is always a challenge, but I'm willing to make all the sacrifices I must make to fulfill my goals. I have the responsibilities of paying bills, and when I don't buy, qualify for, to, for scholarships, I have to pay for tuition. And because I'm considered as an international student, tuition is three times more expensive. It's not easy. It's not easy being 20 years old and having to work hard so your mom and you can eat. And also work on your degree so your mom and you can have a better future. But I know that SRTC has done everything they could to help me get where I am. I have no words to explain how grateful I am to be an SRTC student. I will be on my last semester this next one. And this is thanks to SRTC. Not only because they offer different scholarships for internal students, but the support they give you. When I tell you that SRTC cares for its students, I mean it. They put you as a priority. The biggest benefit of being a student here is that you get a spoil. And I've been taking all my classes online. And on my three years at school, I always experienced the family environment. People smile at you, they treat you well. And they always go above and beyond if you ever have an issue. In my previous semester, I was taking four classes. Not any marketing classes, professional selling classes, business classes, and even psychology. And even though many people think that taking classes online is harder, I am confident to say that our teachers are qualified to bring that support and have everything to make this experience the best. And I actually want to give a shout out to my teacher, Ms. Blalock. She's not here today, but she's my marketing teacher. She's been helping me so much throughout my career. I also want to give a shout out to Ms. Brittany Bryan, marketing director, and everyone in her team, and also to Mr. Glass. Thank you so much for everything because you're doing an amazing job. My goals after graduation are to start my freelance and coaching business take clients and start helping local businesses grow their businesses and sales through social media and eventually grow nationally and only God knows how far he can take me. To be honest, in 30 years, I see myself pretty good and comfortable living the life I always wanted for me and for my family. My best advice for anyone in this room today, whether you want to go to college, get your dream job or grow your own business, is to believe in yourself, start with yourself. If you have that thought in your head, it's because it was meant to be for you. God gave us all the opportunity to live, and he already has the best plans for us. If he puts that thought in your mind and gives you the signs to remind you about it, he will not let you alone. He will walk with you every step of the way, and he will be with you at your highest and lowest. I believe God put SRTC on my way. And I hope that now He's putting me on your way to remind you to go after your dreams. I will not be here if it wasn't for SRTC. I said this before and I will say it again. SRTC taught me to dream bigger. SRTC helped me to believe in myself. And since day one, it has helped me every step of the way. If I had to do this all over again, I will always choose Southern Virginia Technical College. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching the video. I really hope it inspired you today. And let's just keep the conversation going on all my social media platforms that are linked below in the bio. Bye.